time to simulate my early childhood route, guess what I found? Welcome to Miss Hood's School Bus Life. gosh I know exactly where I am I first got married had my children all in this area where I'm driving my route my compound doesn't drive in this area but because the early childhood is over in this area I'm picking up kids close to my elementary school and bringing them to the early childhood program over here it was amazing to me how I had taken these memories and put them in a trunk and stored them in the attic of my brain. I just had totally forgot about this place. I hadn't thought about these places in decades. This just so happens to be the place where my first husband and I bought our first home. I'm on my own time, so I decided that I was going to take a couple of turns. 48 years ago, these trees were just planted. So now I'm curious, what does the old homestead look like? Our very first house. Who would have thought 48 years later I would be driving a school bus here. I continue on my route and lo and behold, I am riding right past the subdivision where we bought our second house. That was the second house that we had. I just moved and I was going through all my pictures and I found the pictures of the kids playing in the backyard of this house. At the end of my high school run, I had to drive down this road and it went right past my first husband's parents' house. We were at that house every Sunday for dinner, come rain or come shine. And now everybody's gone. I had planned to go visit my mother-in-law and tell her. I couldn't wait to tell her. I can't wait to tell my mother-in-law. She will never believe it. I had planned to call her Friday and say, can I stop by on Sunday? Hello? I get home from my run Friday morning and my phone rings. Hello, Rich. Is everything okay? And it's my son. Well, you don't usually call me in the middle of the day and you sound sad. The very day that I was gonna be sitting down with her and telling her about my route, Oh, Rich, I cannot believe this. This can't be true. Please tell me it's not true. It was the day that I stood in the funeral home with family and grieved our great loss. Call me back when you know the details. I love you. It was so sad. On Sunday, this is where we were. It was a hard weekend because on that Monday we buried her. We left the funeral home and drove to the cemetery. We 
took the long way to the cemetery. So we could pass the house where they raised their children. The funeral procession stopped here. I was so excited about being closer to her since I moved. around my bus and all the streets and I didn't get to do that. We came here to say our goodbyes and I never got to tell her about my bus route. I never got to have that conversation with her about all the places I was driving past. She would have loved it. She would have laughed. Several times I've asked myself the question, why didn't you pick up the phone and call her? Because I wanted to see the look on her face. Someday we'll be reunited. It's not just another day in Misfit School Bus Life. This day is one of a kind. Drive safe, everybody.